those who believe in a flat earth don't tell us what it looks like on the underside. We're not prepared for the four elephants and a turtle that we'll see when we get down there. There was also the theory that you can Pac-Man from one edge to the other like you do in the game when you exit one side and appear at the other. Can't make this shit up. You know the earth isn't flat because the edge and underside would already be a fully exploited corporate tourist attraction. I'm convinced that the whole flat earth thing is a big practical joke. These people are just taking piss. What do you mean? It's a cone and we're on the flat circle part. I think it's because they believe we don't know I've heard some stories of an ice wall guarded by NASA and snipers to stop people going beyond it. If the earth was flat, cats would have knocked everything off the edge by now. I thought it was still Australia. Down under. Do they say you can't stick to the other side? Of all the flat earth people I've met, most of them don't care what shape the earth is. These folks just like existing in a place where they can safely disbelieve everything they've been told by people far, far more knowledgeable than they are. Which is why they also they don't believe in seat belts, vaccines, or safety glasses. When the only tool you have is a middle finger, every problem starts to look like the world you were raised on. And when rejection is your only ethos, you can make that world any shape you want. That's the storage area, you just need to find one of the hatches. There's another, flatter earth, with blackjack and hookers. Everything falls off, because we are moving up to keep us on this side. Duh. Only the Lord Marshals of the Necromungers may journey to the Underverse. Obviously that's where the worms live. Humans on one side of the flat earth, worms on the other. You don't have to dig very deep to find a worm. Worms accidentally end up on our side now and then. It's very dangerous for them they get eaten by birds, stabbed with garden forks but sometimes their curiosity gets the better of them. Science is brilliant isn't it? All the ends are hanging loose and it looks really messy, that's why. That's why I don't let you look at the back of my tapestries. A flat earther told me that whoever dared to approach the edge of the earth would be shot dead by some worldwide government or something. NASA has a sticker I want that says, it's round, we checked. They never tell us why NASA should lie to us. I mean what's the benefits? I could care less if the earth is round or flat. That's the southern hemisphere, where else would the Australian be? It's obvious, the only thing you can find there is Australia smiling face with open mouth and tightly closed eyes smiling face with open mouth and tightly closed eyes. We could get there by digging a really deep hole, right? Or would we just fall into space if we did that? I think they are aware the earth is round but double down on disbelieving things they don't personally see or experience. Just because fancy people and suckers believe something they don't have to. It's adjacent to the sovereign citizens movement. Friend went to the convention in Vegas and it was sad and almost empty. As an Australian, I don't know if I should laugh or be offended. But being Australian, I will laugh, cause, Australia. Has anybody ever been to the edge? Go and take a photo. Prove it black heart hash black heart hash black heart hash. A very common trope of a flat earth believer is to feign ignorance and pretend that questioning everything makes you an intellectual skeptic. The only things they will make positive claims about is how the world looks flat from their perspective. Oh, and that NASA is the bane of all evil. No one knows because everyone who's tried has fallen off. Where they've fallen to, I have no idea. In our case, I suspect a bunch of Australians holding on for dear life. Are flat earthers even real? I thought they were just a joke. Earth is flat. That's a fact. But they are keeping it secret because we are on the underside. We would naturally just fall down, but the aliens and people that live on the upside are using some weird alien tech to keep us from falling down. If people knew the truth they would rebel and overthrow the alien suppressors. 
I'm not a flat earther but real flat earthers don't believe the earth is a floating disk. I have unwillingly went through the rabbit hole and have heard plenty enough about the disinformation and controlled opposition that perpetuate the movement. If, I if they were right. The earth would be more of a big wide cylinder. It would have to be thick enough to accommodate the depth of the Pacific Ocean. Specifically the Mariana Trench. What if we are on the crappy underside, and there is a really cool topside that we don't know about? Well, the elites and Illuminati know about it obviously face with rolling eyes. It rests on the back of four elephants who in turn are standing on the back of a giant turtle. That's where the junk is. It's not polite to talk about floating disc coochie. We can never know. It's impossible by any means to figure out anything outside the earth. Anything you see or have been told is a lie. That would be the response. I asked a friend to look over the edge once. And he fell for it. The dinosaurs. They didn't actually go extinct the fossils we find is just us digging into the other side. See the turtle of enormous girth on his shell he holds the earth. His thought is slow but always kind he holds us all within his mind. On his back all vows are made he sees the truth but may not said. He loves the land and loves the sea, and even loves a child like me. Stephen King Do we really care what someone who thinks the earth is flat thinks what the underside of it looks like? It's where she poops. But since she is a she, we pretend she doesn't and don't talk about that. Disappointed by the lack of Stranger Things references in here. Nobody knows and you can't prove it because to date, we have not been able to send a rocket to space, but I can't prove that. The whole world is obviously on a pizza-style plate on top of a turtle come on guys. Well because the only people who have seen it were falling to their deaths. Duh. It's a parallel universe where the monotremes are the dominant mammal clade. I figured it was China. Otherwise, why have I been digging this hole for decades? They can know what's on the underside because they never have been there. They claim we never been to space so by that logic it is make sense. I think this flat earth thing is like a big collective Andy Kaufman kind of joke. This is so weird. I woke up 30 minutes ago randomly thinking about this. If the earth was flat, then why didn't the meteor that killed the dinosaurs, send flat earth into a decaying orbit, of spinning, throwing everything off into space, hum? I'm a flat earth Christian and I believe that hell is underneath. That's because it's elephants. It's clearly elephants who stand on the back of Maturin, the tortoise of enormous girth. Everyone knows that. Dot or where their map came from when we're apparently banned from going to and exploring Antarctica. The problem is that they tend to go straight into gish gallop mode and refuse to consider any single point. All steady reasoned arguments are dismissed as fake. Chuck in a few sciencey sounding terms and move on. The common denominator for conspiracy theorists is that they lack the ability to understand how things like science work. That basic lack of understanding colors most of what they see, so that it won't matter what actual evidence you show them, since they lack how to understand how it works they will not believe it. Bunch of aliens down there, and as I recall they can only come up to the top side through a floor door at some pizza parlor where they eat babies and help draft policies and bills for Democrats. Flat earthers can't even say for sure what it looks like on the top side. And we'll never find out because of the Antarctic Treaty of 1959. The other side is dinosaurs. We just keep digging up their graves. Or where the edge is. Joke theory but TBF 80 of flat earthers are total trolls. Did you think of this from that post this morning of a morning talk show with the flat earther when they showed the flat earth disc and you caught a glimpse of the red underbelly? Cause I thought this exact same thing lol. Well obviously the thrusters that are accelerating us with 9.81 ms squared since they don't believe in gravity so the only explanations would be that we're constantly getting accelerated up since stuff doesn't just fall down on its own.